not an unusual angle for me to be filming at because today is another hair dyeing video. Like, you guys are probably like, Sam, really? You need to come up with something more original. But today is different. We're gonna be trying a brand new brand that I haven't tried before. So I figured I'd make a review. If you see this, it's because I'm on my watch and I can end it without going like that. I'm using Arctic Fox today. Also to go along with the red aesthetic today, we are drinking Code Red Mountain Dew out of a mug with Allie's face on it. Now I've gathered up all my supplies. I have one pair of gloves left. I just got these at the dollar store in like a pack of 10 and they fit. I have the Arctic Fox Poison Hair Dye. It's semi-permanent and I read that it lasts. Um, let's see, color will fade with each shampoo. I think this one was supposed to last for a few weeks. 40 washes, I think it was, if I'm wrong. And then I also have some processing caps because I don't want to get red everywhere while I'm dyeing my hair. Then I have a little, I almost called this a spoon, a brush. I'm not professional. And then again, a bowl that I got at the dollar store. So now we're going to go ahead and I'm going to reread the instructions on this. I think you just put it in the bowl, apply. You're supposed to, like, put Vaseline on your face, but I don't do that because I think that just ruins my hair and it makes it all greasy and oily. So we're going to skip that step and just hope for the best. But I also need to repart my hair. If you, if you haven't seen the last video, I'll well, link it You're up there, right there. I can never tell which angle this is. Um, not my last video, but when I did this, the half red, half black, the black is still really pretty good good my hair is growing in pretty fast so the roots are not the best but that clip cut off for, and i don't really know how so i'm just gonna go ahead and repart and then i will get back to you guys what? <laughs> um i need help parting the back i can't do that with the mirror love of my life now you guys know the secrets to me. I can't do this myself. Oh, you're recording. So now that I did a really terrible job parting this, this is supposed to be over here. But I'm going to find a bobby pin and bobby pin this back. Uh, this is only up so high because when I have the cap, I'm just going to put my entire head in it. And I'm excuse me for the terrible straightening job. I did it late last night and just it was kind of a rush job. So I'm going to... Go ahead and completely fix this top part because there's quite a bit of black and bobby pin it over here and I will be back again. So I very, very horribly have that pin back. Sorry, I'm very tired. I'm trying to stay awake. My hair is getting really long. Do you guys remember when I had that sh super short like shaved head? That's a throwback. I'm just going to go ahead and grab one more thing that I need. You're going to want to clip. This is not a tutorial. But you're gonna always want a hair clip when you're dyeing your hair. I'm gonna go ahead, section this, get my gloves on, and I'm just gonna record a little bit of me putting it on and like the overall review of the product because that's what this video is. And I will be kind of rating it at the end. I'll be rating it on how it smelled, how easily it was distributed in my hair. I'm gonna forget all of this. So. I don't know if I'm gonna rate it. This video is going to be an absolute mess, but I'm definitely gonna tell you guys that it's gonna look better than this when we are done. I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture of this ugly stuff, and we're gonna go ahead and get started. Now that I look crazy, <laughs> I looked crazy before this, with this, but that's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and slip the gloves on. Move the caps out of the way. I don't need those till after we already have the product in my hair. And I already did a little bit of research on this dye. That's that's why I got it. I made sure it was the color I wanted. This is the brighter of the reds. It's poison. There's a, another red that I don't remember what it's called. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take this off and see if there's like a little protective film on there, S as suspected pull that off you guys can already tell that that is super red so I hope that this is the color we are going for yeah, throw that way 
overall it doesn't smell bad it's definitely not good but it's hair dye what do you expect so i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna put just some in here i can always put more in there when i am done and need more no on the bottle it says no peroxide no ammonia no ethyl alcohol no ppd so it's also cruelty free and vegan just so you guys know um it says leave in hair for 30 minutes for best results cover hair with a plastic cap that's why i got the um that process with heat and blow dry up for up to thir up to 15 minutes i don't think i'm gonna do that i might we'll see rinse hair in cold water away from your face otherwise it'll like get your face which i know um the color will fade with each shampoo and may last longer depending on hair type condition i don't know how to say that word products and styling so can't guarantee how long this is gonna last in your hair so we're gonna go ahead and put some product in the bowl. I'm really scared, you guys. I have never used this brand, but a friend of mine um, said it was pretty good. So we'll see. She's the one who I got the half and half hair dye hair idea from. Oh my God. You guys cannot see how red that is. It looks pink. But we're gonna go with it. I hope that I have enough in this bottle. It doesn't feel like I'm gonna have enough this is just the four ounce bottle because I did not feel like going out of my way and buying eight ounce because no so we're gonna work with this and um I should have took my choker off but it's too late so we're gonna we're just gonna start and I'm gonna talk to you guys because I'm bored I can't remember the last time I uploaded a YouTube video <laughs> as you can see this is like pink and the dye is supposed to be red so let's see Sorry guys, I am not good at filming while I am dying because I get sidetracked and I just focus on the dying process. Alright. I'm just sparingly putting a little bit on here because I don't want to like use it all up right away and not have any for the rest of my head. If all else fails, I do have some red splat left, but I want to avoid using that because that is what ruined my hair to this ugly, pinky, orangey, nasty color in the first place. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply it to the strand here. Then after the strand, I think I'm just going to go ahead and do it all. I don't know if I'm going to time lapse. I don't think I will. Because you guys don't want to see me do this all the time. Because this is just more of a product review. I want to get to the point so far. It's applying very nicely to my hair. It's not sticking too much to the brush. As you can tell, it's pretty good. All right. Arctic Fox, so far you are you're doing me good. So, go ahead and finish up this little bit here and then I'm going to end the clip, apply it to the rest of my hair and come back and show you guys what it looks like. Alright, so we're at the final layer, and I figured I'd come back and show you guys how it's going. It's definitely going. Um, pretty good. Actually, this dye is very good. I've only refilled the bowl once so far. I might have to do it one more time before we're done. There's going to be a little bit of black just chilling in here, but you know what? We're just going to roll with it because I don't care enough to fix it. It's not going to be covered anyway, it's just going to be a little bit lighter black, but it's very great. I will definitely buy it again. It's not a toxic smell, but then again it's hair dye, so it's like, it doesn't smell perfectly good. It's just, it works. It's doing good so far. I don't know if you guys can tell, this is really red down here, and that's the look I was going for. Right now we are just getting all the final little pieces of my hair. And I'm actually gonna just leave it at that and I'm gonna go ahead and finish it up and then come back when it's completely in my hair. Alrighty, we got the dye in. It's kind of weird, like it's really kind of bright 
bright red in the camera, but it's not that bright in real life and I'm kind of nervous because the point is I wanted it to be bright, obviously. So I'm going to go ahead and clip this out of my way and we are going... No, I don't think I'm going to clip it. I think I'm just going to put it in the cap. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. Now that I look kind of crazy, I'm just going to go ahead and fix it on this side so that way it's even. It's kind of not all... There we go. Everything's in there. And we're going to go ahead and let it sit for 30 minutes. It is exactly 7.30. And we are going to let it sit until about 8 or until I feel like it. It doesn't say I have to rinse it. At least 30 minutes. So it can sit for longer. So knowing me, it'll probably sit for like an hour because I get really sidetracked when I'm just waiting. I'm just going to enjoy my... Mountain Dew in Allie's mug. As always, I just realized I forgot to get gloves to rinse my hair with. So my hands are gonna be red once we rinse. So like I said, it's been an hour. I'm gonna go ahead and go rinse it in the sink because I have to rinse it in cold water. I don't wanna rinse my whole body in cold water. Plus I already showered last night. Where are you? Let's go. Time to blow dry, straighten, and style. And we are done. We are parted and back to normal. And look at that. That looks so much better than before. So, that's what it looks like. It's a little crazy in the back, it doesn't really line up right. But I'm gonna go rinse my mom's hair because I did hers and then I'm gonna close out the video and then go edit this. So fun. So she's taking longer than expected to come down here. So I'm just gonna close it out right now. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the post notification bell because I do not have a normal upload schedule, nor will I ever. Make sure to follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. I'll follow you back. We can be best friends. Everything will be linked down below. And make sure to check out the last hair dyeing video to see how I accomplished this beautiful yeah, half red, half black. And until then, I will see you guys later.